but at the end, like, did you just say, dab it at the end? I felt like an idiot because I had to explain to her, like, <laughs> I'm just going to walk around with a little bit of pee in my pants all day long. Just two or three drops of pee in my underwear. That's my plan. That's what me and every man alive have decided. A thousand years ago, we're not dabbing anything with anything. What do you think we're doing? All any of us are doing is shaking it. That's all we've come up with is shaking it for a while. That's our big plan. We love to do that. That gets a little pee on the outside of your pants every single time you do that. Oh, little on the inside and the outside now. That's good. I've flung a radius of pee on my clothes like I do every morning. <laughs> now I'm ready to earn money and meet women. I think it's going to be an easy life for me. I remember when my dad taught me that. He was like, all right, son, and now we shake. And I said, this doesn't work. And he goes, I know. I got to teach you something. No. Whenever you're at a gas station, you just watch. Whenever a guy's done pumping, you always go like this. Shake that pump for a while. It's like, what do you think you're doing there? I don't even know what I'm doing. This is, this is just a habit I got. Now I'm flinging flammable shit everywhere because nobody ever taught me anything. <laughs> because nobody ever taught me. Scientists do that. Scientists shake their dicks and go, all right, back to cancer. I bet we're close. We are not. So I told her all that. She didn't think it was funny. She goes, what they should do is they should put... I, this, uh, this next joke is about the morn. Hello? Is this the microphone? No, this is the microphone. Psych. Not really. Okay, that's a, that's a bad start. Whoa, shit. All right, Lucifer. So the sunglasses, the sunglasses come out in the morn, and that's when the, that's when they start to take. If you don't believe that Lucifer lives every single day, you go to that fucking job that you go to. I don't think that you're gonna like this next song very much. I was walking away by Lucifer's pay, but he wants me to believe, believe, believe in you. As Venus rises and it comes across, it dances in the sky like a bus full of women, I guess, and Lilith there, the one who scared you into fear. You know it's nice to take a knowledge bite from a tree or a kite. Did you know about kikes and of Jews and of hikes? If you know those words, you probably have parents like mine, or you live with swine. Either way, you gotta say, I love my life either fucking way. So you know, if you do, let him in through the back door, you really say. What's that beat? Does he have to repeat? 
Like a melody that doesn't know anything And they'll you till you bring the range that <coughs> Dries paint off walls What? Yeah man, I mean fuck like Alright, like uh, you guys, you guys ever hear that famous uh, rock star, guitar legend guy that they, everybody was just like, oh, he's gotta, he's gotta have had the devil with him because there's no way that a person with like almost no talent in that particular area before disappeared and came back and all of a sudden they could play tuned guitars or untuned guitars, it didn't matter to them. You can give without loving, but you can never love without giving. This is a book that my mom gave me, or it said the word mom in it or something, one of, one of them. It's hard for your brain to know all the time. Whoops. This is going to be perfect material for the anti-cannabis campaigns. Because uh, it doesn't matter if you're just, you just perceive life a little bit differently in general. And if you respond well to those things, then they come when they come. But uh, you never really know if the thing does come unless they come. If you know what I mean. And if you don't know what I mean, then you're not gonna like this next joke. I'm just joking. No, I'm just joking. We're all idiots. I feel like people watch me do this and they think I must be putting a coat on or something. But it's got nothing to do with codeine or whatever, the oxyprofen. I don't take any of those pills nonsense. Don't take any of those pills nonsense. I don't take any of those pills nonsense if you think it through. It don't make no sense because you gotta spend money to make it. You gotta give it to one other man because, because it must be a man. He's not from Venus, he's not there. There's no emotional breath. So if Lucifer's from Venus, then I want to be where the planets land. Oh, whatever. Something like that, you know what I mean? It's like everybody's... Whoa! Everybody's got a song. Everybody's got a song. Do the Lucifer... Do Lucifer part two. How's that one go? Sing some of it to me. All right. Sure. When you, when you eat the devil's salad through your eyes and ears and your mouth it goes 
across the sky like a planet and you thought you knew that guy but it's 10 a.m. in the morning Lucifer's up But as the planets, they swing Like a dog between your knees So be careful, cause we all got them teeth It's like a banjo show with no Joe So just ban some other Joe Cause if Jesus isn't here, we'll just name some other guy and write it down wrong. Cause if you don't live in the forest, you probably don't have a name from a town you were from. No one really fucking knew where Nazareth was. It was a small town Just like when Mecca before crown <laughs> Cause if you don't remember you grow up And then you leave the place where you end up and if you don't like it, then don't question it. But leaving's part of its status quo abolishment. You believe in laws I don't like you. What's your deal if you remind you? The laws of man are written on hearts, but they're not really written there in our thoughts. If you don't like it, then eat my cock. But if you don't mind, I don't trust you much. If you are gonna eat, you gotta know what you speak. Cause gastrointestinal health is as important as your body, your brain. So don't complain much about energy fights when you don't even process organic thoughts. <laughs> oh, huh. I like that. Like now, now I feel like this microphone is on. I'm like, oh right, yeah, microphones. Testing one two, flip the blue. Test two one two, hit. Three, land knowledge with me, L liberty, C come from away, don't, don't touch me. <laughs> if you don't like my keys, then you don't like me. And if you don't like my notes, then you won't like my quotes. So take your quotes like a queefing fart, like a queefing dot right from your mother's farts. Oh man, like I love Mother Nature. I, I just, we got any Mother Nature fans here in the in the house? Wait, 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 wait. Hey yo, yo, you, you, you there, you there. You like it? You like the nature? You like you like your mother? How do you how do you speak to her? You treat her nice? You you do? Uh, you know we we even even cows are smart. Uh, dolphins too, you know, they got the languages. Do you know the thoughts? Do you know the thoughts? Hmm. What if I could prove to you in some way the intellectual capacity for like uh, memory expansion and like just like hanging out with a monkey or like a whoever, it doesn't matter, it's not an orangutan, it's a dog, it's a cat, I don't care, who cares, what are you talking about, it's a dolphin.
Did that did that help your case to for the psychosis or insanity or whatever it is that you're gonna decide to prove and label and <laughs> fuck with my reality because I'm fucking with your power. That's what it is at the end of the day. They go, hey, fuck, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. wait, wait, who's this other, who's this other guys? And they go like, oh yeah, no, they were always around. They, they, um, weed's been legal in Canada for like my whole life. So, do you guys remember history? We look it up sometimes. I've looked it up. I like it. I like to know about it. I think that um, philosophy got a bad rap when I was in <laughs> when I was in high school. I didn't even know that shit like that existed. Some of my friends, I bet, maybe even took business courses. But as far as I tell people, my school never had any business courses or philosophy or whatever, I think. Pretty sure they might have had philosophy classes um theology. I think it's kind of funny when places like high schools, groups of, like, young newly hormoned, uh, you know, they're like, they're past their second life in a way, they're coming into their own, they're like, they're in that stage where it's like, yo, I'm just like, rocking it from my next life. Being seven was cool, but now I'm 14, yo, yo, 12 years old, kill, killing it, <laughs> like a fucking steam horse. It's a thing, fucking look it up if you don't bother me with your questions about steam horses. Obviously, it's a thing. If you don't know what it is, then maybe you don't deserve to go on the iron trail with the horses or the bikes. Don't worry about it. Eh? <laughs> are you guys are you guys alright with this? Uh, yeah, so, uh, the next joke's gonna be about hospitals or whatever, I guess. Just wanna set you up. Just pretend this is an airplane. Just getting my oxygen here. And if you don't get my joke, then look up why it is that you use oxygen in an airplane. I was going to say Jefferson, and then I was like, I don't know, that's like, that's too on the nose. I don't even know what you are. You're a Jeff? Yeah, I mean, like, I don't know, man. Like, do you, uh, do you mind if I call you Jess? I'd rather that. Jesse? Jefferson. Fuck. Don't worry, we'll come up with a name with, for you. <laughs> what a fucking... That's... Uh, sorry about that if... Uh, whatever, but that's an unfortunate name. If you've ever known a Jeff or a Jeff type, then you know who I'm talking about. You like this shirt? I'm getting a little fat. Or I think I'm getting, like, less fat. <laughs> there you go. That's, that's what's important about going to these places, though, too. They go, it's good, it's good. It's good to be fed well. And, like, holy shit, man, like... Yeah... But, you know, I did definitely prefer when, uh, you know, we could go on hikes or whatever else. Or, like, interact with nature. And, like, have therapy through activity. Because, like, it's all these places are about, like, rehabilitation and whatever else. And we'll, we'll learn about that stuff, but not necessarily 
They won't necessarily dive into like, all right, guys, let's get you into. Um, okay, cool. Yeah, you're into that. Okay, so uh, this guy, this person, this gal. Get some gals. I was I was thinking about the one place in Ottawa. That like during the COVID stuff too, like they were like, Alright, everybody get in the car, we're going to the beach. And I'm like, oh fuck, like Oh I like sorta of like I'm glad that we're doing it because you know, my buddy wanted to go. But hey, I got to like meet some old ladies and watch them pick up cardboard boxes and take them to the house. Like, uh... You know. Like we all hope to be when we're old. All of us! <laughs> That's how, like, old presidents talked, right? I'm um, just joking. I'm just joking. Did you hear, you hear about the uh, death by firing squad or whatever else they're doing in the States? I think it was a law before, but it's like more, more, more of a law. Hey, what's the news about the beheadings or whatever? Let me just check my sources. Yeah. Yeah, but like this is a thing. What do you guys like about this? Oh, do you like how funny I'm talking? Do you like that I'm like being silly, or does that like bother you? Does that make you think that like that's what happens when the devil's whatever gets into you? What do you guys call it? The devil's salad. It's the old, old salad fingers over here. What is this, the internet? From like, not five minutes ago? <laughs> what is this, some other different experience than the right now experience? Which one are you in? What space are you in on the timeline of the world that is referred to in that way? Look it up. You don't know what I'm talking about? Look it up. You know, just, uh, it's better when you can find something that sounds good. Hey, that's a good setup. I like that you can still see the, the beard. That's my, that's my buddy there. His head's, uh, a little smaller than what you can see, but... The camera's not, not great at showing both, but I, I hope you can see it. I hope you can see that there's a guy there. There's also uh, at least one skateboard in the frame. Um, can you where's Waldo the room for a little bit?
this right? How much am I bowing? How much am I bowing? Whoa! Comedy Central has 38 viewers currently. Kind of puts uh, put some stuff into perspective for you, right? We got this. We got this guy here talking about Lucifer like he's some sort of gym athlete. Like, hey, yo, uh, it's raining there. Which which direction do you want to spit into the wind? <laughs> yeah, you didn't know that. Uh, yeah, that's a uh, Lilith's wife. Yeah. When it rains. Yes. There's strong evidence to suggest that. Yeah, it's it's an analogy to being the. It's we're getting wet here. It's the rain. It's a, it's a real bitch, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's a real fucking Lilith fucker. Yeah. I hope they beat each other. Wouldn't that be nice? Do you like that? It's uh, similar to the joke from earlier, but it's uh, more contextualized. Yeah. You mind if I borrow your phone charger? I was just coming in for a quick chat. Yeah, no, we can... Oh, yeah, well, you guys want to play some cards or something? And just uh, leave the garage door open a bit and just kind of like... We got this homemade beer here or whatever else. Uh, you want me to pour you a glass? Oh, sure, why not? Yeah, f fine, I'll have a drink as well. But then you got those assholes that are in there for the fucking money too, right? Where they go, oh fuck, cards, oh cool, can we play? It's always poker. It's always, you gotta be ready. On the ready, bruh. What this? Card game books available at 50 cents each. Official rules of card games. Where's the thing? Somebody fucking with my wallet? Taking out all my fucking cards and putting them in the wrong order? Jesus Christ. I need your help right now, Jesus. Serenity now. Yeah, there we go. This stuff's probably just backwards. That's the card right there. It's supposed to be at the front of my wallet. This one's fucking with my shit. And then it has, uh, it has uh, different colors there, too. Do you like it? Do you want me to show you more? Yeah, so you just you carry this fucking thing around. Excuse my mother's tongue. There's that... And then that's the same thing on the other side for the monochromatic. <clears throat> They're like, what are we going to do with all this red ink? Yeah, just do a monochrome. Um, yeah, but there's a... Uh, oh, and that's the French side, too, is the monochrome. Royal Flush. Four of a kind is number three. Straight flush is number two. A two three. A four is full house. A six straight. Three of a kind. Eight pair. Oh, two pair. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this card's pretty handy, and uh, once I learn how to read, it's gonna really. Uh, be even handier. For, and these guys know all these friggin' tricks and stuff too, because then uh, after after you get uh, past a certain age and play cards, people people are doing it for money. That is the purpose of a lot of people's lives. And I mean, don't don't get me wrong, because like I, if you feel differently, then uh, you know. 
fuck you. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Like, not, not fuck you, but like, I don't know. Do you want me to say fuck you to you? Is that... It seems like that's what people want normally. They're like, you, can you just be a prick to me for a little bit so I can fucking hate you? And you're like, oh, okay, uh, no problem. What do you prefer? Uh, that you eat cunts or are you still very strongly opposed to sexuality as well? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, you mind if I, I'm, I'm gonna not even ask you and I'm gonna light a cigarette there and maybe we can just listen for a little while and, um, seems like you, you got some things that you're talking about there, huh? That's uh, interesting. What, 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 what kind of, what kind of hate groups are you part of? We probably know the same people. <laughs> Through a friend of mine. I think my friend knows your friend. I don't think that he is friendly with my friend necessarily, uh, vice versa. I forget how political they both are with each other, violent, but, uh, yeah, um... Yeah, well, yeah, well. that being said, like, if you want to get together and throw some bricks sometimes, they don't have to be real, but, you know. You got my number. And, oh, you don't? Well, that's fine, too. It's okay. I can give you my address. But, uh, I have to warn you, there's some rules on my front door that need to be complied with. Um. You know what, those rules kind of need to be followed moving forward at all if you'd like to know me whatsoever. And they're pretty simple, it's like, uh, like, do your best not to be a fucking prick. Remember to try to not be as much of a prick sometimes around me, if you want. But you can be, you feel natural to be who you are. But, um... Just so you know, I might be calling you out on your shit one day. If you don't mind. I mean, either way, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> so, that's probably enough. 36 minutes. Uh, you guys want me to do some jokes about, uh, candles and, uh, bring it home with some hospital jokes? Hospital jokes? You know it's a really good hospital joke? When I stretch most days and, yeah, there's my foot over there. You saw my toe. I have proof. You saw it. I'm real. I'm not a bot. And maybe I am. It's possible that this is simulated because our technology is so good now that I'm not the only one that's able to do my friend's voice and steal his jokes and the way that he would be talking about, like, you know, cracking open one of those donuts. Fucking taking a look, see, uh, see what the flavor is there. You got a white hole there, huh? Yeah. Yeah, they call me Tin Cup. <laughs> nah, I'm just joking. But you can call me Fuzzy. If you want. That's like a name that I go by. I also go by Pee Pee sometimes, or Grandpappy Pee Pee. Yeah. Yeah, don't worry about it. You're pretty good looking yourself. <laughs> Liberty! Yeah, but I mean, like, there's, uh, there's sticks for different things, obviously, too. Like, this one, this one is very long, so if you need to poke something or, like, you know, like, break something... Or like scare your friend by putting a stick near his face. I'm just joking. Don't do that. 
That's not what these sticks are for. Shit. 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 Pussy. 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 Right? Oh. Oh, okay. This is this is the little guy. Is just like fucking. I was gonna say grooting it up, but like you just sort of like maybe like a relative of that imaginary. Uh, this is this is real. It's got like a backpack of like. It's like a star child. What is this crazy shit? And my friend cut his penis off. He used to have a penis. <laughs> right there. Now it's like more like a clitoris. Little bean. Quite a decent sized bean. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, it's it it is it is interesting how many people uh forget or don't know how to have a little bit of fun with themselves or others. <laughs> you know, some people, right? It's just like, but I don't have the time for it either sometimes, you know? I mean, it's just like, but then you yeah, gotta remember, like, oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck, yeah, sorry. There's, there's, there's a person thing going on here. Oh, right, yep. I'm gonna forget about the social awkwardness of whatever's going on. And I'm just gonna... For the lack of uh, better words in my tongue of mouth right now, you gotta kind of balls up, you know what I mean? You gotta just like take those ovaries and freaking take them for everything that they're worth. Take them, <laughs> take them for everything that they're worth. And then take it back a little bit. Because you want to tell them that, you know, you got their fucking... That you got their ovaries in your hands, huh? Which is kind of crazy, because that's like holding creation. When people say that they got the world by the balls, that's kind of cool, because it's like, it's a creation factory. Little rolls of toilet paper next to you. There you go, you got the toilet got paper it. things. We got the... I said, if you do that, men are going to start shitting in urinals. That is all that is going to happen. Oh, we can shit in these? Fuck yeah, I've been waiting. I've been waiting to shit standing up like a real man. Huh? My brother's in prison. <laughs> he just got a cell phone, which was good at first, but now he calls home too much, you know what I mean? It's to the point where we started ignoring his calls. And now he's getting hostile and angry about it. He tried to check me the other day. He was like, hey, bro, I called you. I was like, yeah, man, my bad. Oh, I thought he was talking about Trump. Like, doing what? I was like, nigga, enjoy my freedom. Like, what do you mean? <laughs> If you'd like to tune in to other videos, uh, I do a thing. See, this is this is what these mirrors are good for, is to be able to like see that screen and that screen if I'd like to when I'm standing over here. Yeah, but we got this stuff here. We got a toilet paper real piece of work there, made in China. Uh, two ninety nine 
a tasty market. So, uh, relay a kiss back to me. <laughs> I made a video, a shower video, you guys might want to tune into. Uh, he was talking about poops there and toilet paper. And I didn't want to tell you right away about my poop video. So, uh... Yeah, I got a shower video, though, that is not made yet. Um, mostly because I think that uh, I was doing, like, the shower beer video and was like, hey, I might as well. And then once I had the joints in there and stuff, too, I was like, I think that I might have taken mushrooms in the video. I'm trying to remember if that was the same day. I think it was. So that's... I think that's part of why I haven't released it yet, was because I, I made like hours and hours of footage, and um, yeah, yeah, no it's okay, yeah. Yeah, I'm around, you just uh... Look me up when you need me. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Yeah, all right, you too. <laughs> well, okay. Yeah, that sounds all right. Oh. Wait, did you mean to send me that? Because, like... You were implying before uh, there's like a friend thing going on now. Uh, did I fuck it up? Oh, you don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, okay. Yeah, fuck, I fucked it up. Fuck. No, I didn't fuck it up. No. It's always not time to unfuck something. To unfuck something. Okay. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. In my pooping video, I show you all how to stand up onto the toilet seat and relieve yourself uh, all in under two minutes. And then I've got even another video that's even shorter. I think it's like maybe 10 or like 12 seconds or something. But like, poops don't take long if you're not hurting your body to get them out of you. Jesus. Oh my gosh, and like, not having proper bidet when I was in all these other institutions and whatever else. Holy, I got hemorrhoids in the last place. I got my foot broke and my ribs broke by the security in the first place by being like, oh, yeah, no, it's cool. I think there was a bit of a misunderstanding. I just, I, I lived down the street. Uh, my, my mom was here for some a hip replacement. I was just taking care of her for the last few weeks uh, at, at her place. And, you know, I, I, went, I went to my house and I've been reorganizing. So, uh... Yeah, things, uh, things look different. Um, oh, you're gonna, oh, I've never had all of the air taken from my body before. That's the scariest thing ever. I hope no one else jumps on me in the next year and takes all of the air from my body and tries to break my neck on a stool because I told them that they showed up in a house unannounced. You just walk into... Since when are, uh, like, police... I know that, like, regular people can do crazy things like that. And, like, maybe you can get out of them because it's like, Whoa, hey, yo, uh... Oh, hey, uh... Oh, hey, hi, ho, ha! What you doing in my car there, kid? <laughs> Mom came home the other day and, uh... Maybe I'll tell you later. I'll tell you the story about how my mom was uh, on mushrooms and decided to go for swimming. 
She didn't. She didn't know she was on them. But I. I couldn't. She had digested something that I told her not to touch, and I was like, "Oh, yeah, I'll hang out with you. <laughs> Maybe I'll have some rice too, just a little bit. I had some earlier." Do we have any eggs? And mom's just like doing chin-ups on the diving board. It's like, yeah.